of the more important days in a young gun dog's life is the day that it's introduced to gunfire. For obvious reasons, this has to be done correctly. And there are various methods of doing it. I use a particular method I've always found it successful. I bring the younger dog with an older dog, experienced dog, a dog that's heard many shots, and I bring them together. Young dogs will take cues from the older dogs, I find. So if, when you fire the shot, if the older dog doesn't show any concern, which it won't, well then the younger dog should naturally respond to that and not be concerned either. I use this gun here, it's a 6mm blank fire. It's quite loud, it's probably as loud as a 20 bore shotgun. So I deliberately choose a windy day, so that when I fire the shot, a, a large part of the shot is swallowed up in the wind, basically, and the sound is not as penetrating. Now there are other techniques, as I say, people use various methods and various techniques to introduce their dog to shot. I find that this one works well for me. So I'm now going to go to the field with two dogs, one other dog and the pup concerned, and I'm going to introduce the shot for the very first time. Let's hope it goes well. This is Heather on the left, seven months old, Teal on the right, three year old. Today's a big day for Heather. First and time hearing gunfire. Like I say, a very important day in any gun dog's life is their first day hearing gunfire. And I've enlisted the aid of Teal because she's heard many, many shots in her career. So she knows exactly what's going on. And Heather will inevitably take her cue from the other dog. That's why I've brought Teal along today. Heather will look to the older dog for the cue. If the older dog seemed concerned, well then she'd be concerned. So hopefully, Um, everything will go according to plan. And there won't be any adverse reaction. It's important to choose the right moment. Hopefully when the two dogs are close together so that the younger dog will take the cue from the older dog. In other words, if the older dog doesn't seem concerned about the shot, well, the younger dog probably won't be either. So I'm watching now for the right moment. Yeah, there goes a snipe. She didn't pay any heat to the shot. Perfect. Go. She was distracted by the snipe that just got up there. She. There goes a the second shot. Perfect. No problem whatsoever. Now, having watched the video there, you can see that everything went entirely according to plan. There was no adverse reaction from the pup. Everything went well. But I had this, it had been carefully contrived so that everything would go according to plan. Basically, if you're not sure about introducing your puppy to gunshot, well, it might be wise to consult a professional trainer or someone who's done it before and somebody knows what they're doing. If you get it wrong, you can make your, your dog gun shy and ruin any prospect of it being a gun dog in the future. So consult a professional trainer if necessary Otherwise, try this method, it works for me, has always done. Thanks for watching.